Alright, so, I'm gonna just tell you guys straight up, we're getting an OG character in Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 with DLC Pack 6, and we're also getting a new form for Goku. Now, I'm not going to sit here and say that we're gonna get Ultra Instinct Goku, even though I'm 95.5% sure that it is going to be Ultra Instinct Goku. I'm not gonna confirm it on this channel, I'm not gonna say that it's confirmed due to the fact that we might get some BS like some false Super Saiyan Goku or something like that. Like I, I have no control of this game and I don't want to be wrong about this. So I'm just going to throw it out here that we are getting a new form of Goku. I think that we are going to get Ultra Instinct Goku even though that's not confirmed. And we're going to be getting the OG character. A lot of people think that this is going to be Jiren. But honestly, I don't think that they're speaking about Jiren in this post. And by the way, guys, this is on Bandai Namco's official European website. I don't think that they're speaking about Jiren because I personally feel like this DLC is going to be based around the Terminal Power. And I don't see why they would call just Jiren an OG character if they're going to be adding other characters from the Tournament of Power. I'm thinking that they're going to be adding a whole new character that we've never seen before and incorporate that into the Tournament of Power. I mean, I don't know why they would bring up so much Tournament of Power stuff and then just never give it to us. I mean, as you guys can see, my man's is flexing on the top left with the Pride Trooper outfit on. Um, so I definitely feel like this DLC is going to be about, um, what's it called, Tournament of Power. But I do think that in this article or in this post specifically, they're speaking about a character we have never seen before because I don't see why they would just exclusively call Jiren an OG character if they were also bringing other characters from the Terminal of Power. I feel like they would have said three OG characters will be added to the game as opposed to just one OG character will be added to the game. Now, of course, this is all just speculation. It's not even confirmed that the Terminal of Power is going to be DLC 6, but I really, I strongly believe that that will end up being the case. Um, if that isn't the case, then I do feel like that they will actually end up incorporating a whole new story that we've never seen before to make DLC 6. Personally, I'm content with both. I, I don't care. Just as long as it's cool and I can play with some new characters I've never played before with and they have some really cool cinematics in the story mode and stuff like that, I'm, I'm straight. I'm straight personally. Um, something else that I've noticed no one else has spoken on. They could end up adding Goku's Kaioken times 20 Super Saiyan Blue. Now that would piss people off. I know that would piss people off. <laughs> but that is something they could end up adding. I mean, it is one of Goku's new forms that we have not seen in Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 yet. But I mean, hey, it's up to them. We're just speculating until we get some more information on this, guys. Let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did not enjoy this video, I don't know what to tell you, but if you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, as well as turn on my notifications, guys. Make sure to have a wonderful day. I'm out, bruh.